Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne, this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Season 6, Episode 10 of Arrow, and it's called Divided. So we start off with uh, Bert and Ellie uh, trying to work a deal with some other people. And then they mention the Hunters, because it's um, his cousin. So um, then James comes in and interrupts and wants the port and the pier. And uh, he's like, uh, no, you can go. <laughs> so Black Siren uh, literally blasts him, but not enough to really hurt him, just kind of throw him off and just kind of threat intimidate him or threaten him. And so they give him 40 hours to comply or else. Then we cut to where Curtis shows um, up at the lair uh, to help out Diggle with his um, arm. And then we cut to where Thea and Lance talk, and then uh, Lance turns out he fired Renee, and he needs new people in. And so, um, so Thea is like like the chief chief of staff, basically there. <clears throat> and then the original team era knows is uh, something weird when Diggle is um, they're trying to use the new microchips, and. Um, and also, it doesn't work, so they've um, so they're trying to re uh, strategize and think and stuff. Then um, Curtis leaves, and then Felicity finally figures out what's going on. And he did, she doesn't say it; she texts it to on uh, Diggle, so they figure it out. <clears throat> then Dinah talks to Vigilante, and they want to do a day at the pier for the next night. And so they have the original team are, are talking. And so uh, Diggle says that uh, Lila said they can use Argus um, base as a temporary hideout. So they can discuss a plan. And then we have Bert and Ellie um, trip some alarm. And so in order to bring out um, Oliver, you know, the arrow. So they um, <clears throat> they talk about Kate and James. And then I don't say the original team. I don't say OTA. So the OTA are Argus. And he um, got the information from Bertinelli so they can figure out how to track James. And so uh, <clears throat> then we cut to Renee and his daughter taught Zoe. Then Curtis stops by as well. And Renee kind of feels guilty for what he did. And then asks Curtis to erase the, the dirt because pretty much digital, to, uh, digital. So he's like, can you just hack in and erase this is back to the DA's office. It's not really a federal thing anymore. So um, Curtis says he'll do it. Then you have the Dina day, and she's being a freaking chatty Kathy. I never heard her talk so fast and so long in my, so far this series. And then uh, Vigilante has to leave in the middle of the day. And then Oliver and Thea talk. Then Felicity found Kate and James by running a... Um, License plate check on the car. So, um, he offers shows up, and he first he's doing pretty good, like really good fight scenes and stuff. And but James brought friends, and I mean, I had a bunch of friends. He brought them the Paratha and whoever else I forgot who else it was, but he managed to escape because James let him technically let him go. And then the OTA bicker, but agreed to show intel to the rest, to everyone that was on the team that are no longer on the team. And then um, we cut to where Thea tells to Lance, and at first she thought he was drinking again, but he was just going through a photo album. And um, he thinks he can help Laurel, but um, Thea's kind of on the fence about it. And then OTA gives info to everyone, and it does not go well. <laughs> It's like, I feel like you had 24 hours to give us information and you didn't. Wow. And then Oliver um, goes to talk to Bernelli. And so they're going to work together until we're out, James. And then Dinah confronts Vigilante and he basically goes ham on her and knocks her out. Then Diggle doesn't like Oliver's idea and. The idea is planting bombs at the warehouse and just all that type of stuff happening. So that will take out everybody. And <clears throat> so then Curtis and Renee are bickering. But he found an audio file that um, basically they think that 
Watson got to um, incriminate Renee, and that was the main person she was after to get on the crack. But here's the thing, they didn't listen to the file yet, so I have my own thoughts about this. So anyway, uh, then Dinah storms in, and then they form a team. Then James overhears OTA give the information, which they did on purpose. So then everyone is at the warehouse, and then you have the weird camera work with the fight scenes, because the fight scenes were really good, but it was just kind of weird camera work. It was like too in your face, like a reality show. I was like, woo. But I, said, I don't know how I really feel about that one. And then it's Vigilante versus Arrow, and then Bertinelli um, sides with James when Oliver gets pinned down. So um, he sides with James in the place. Um, kind of blows up, but not all the way up. And then, um, <laughs> Jane takes care of Bertinelli, so he's like, bye. And then we have, um, I'll, then we cut to a listen to him, because, um, Oliver was able to escape. And then Oliver talks to everyone, and he says sorry, and asks them to be on the team again. They say no, and they're going to form their own team. And then Curtis thinks he fished the glitch with the chip. Try to say that five times fast. And then uh, Thea gives Lance uh, more pictures of Laurel, and then Thea wants to help try to convince um, Earth 2 Laurel to be good. Kind of like Earth 1. So, uh, <clears throat> and then we cut to where Thea, uh, sorry, then uh, Curtis shows the new team his lair. So that's going to be really interesting. And then James is Crimson's a vigilante, and he says, don't worry about it, I know how to take care of Dinah. And then um, Felicity puts the chip in, and the implant works, so he can do all the things he needs to do now. So that, super cool. So I really did enjoy this episode. I'll give this an A. The only thing I'll give um, a plus was some weird camera work. That just felt weird to me. So, um... I'm very interested to in know about the audio file that Curtis found because I wonder why they didn't play that. I feel like that's going to be essential for our episode coming up, so I really, I'm very curious about that. And I think Earth 2 Laurel will eventually work with Arrow, um, Team Arrow. I just don't know when. I think it'll be about maybe three episodes in. I think around 13 or 14. I think she'll start to switch size. The Jarius are kind of. Um, you know, kind of switch sides just a little bit when she let Lance go. So, it'll be very interesting what happens with that. So, yeah. I think that's going to do it for this episode. Um, I'm, I'm excited to see what's going to happen next. So, if you like this, like this video, please give it a like, comment down below what you think, and then subscribe for more stuff. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.